Actually, quite the scene there. Well, McGuinn Road, where we just saw Ashley, was one area that saw a ton of damage. Chomper 9 flew over that area today, getting a unique perspective. Take a look. Several snapped trees, building missing half its roof there, and even more trees down before we see the damage on Brent Reed's home there. And uh, this evening, well, more tense moments for several families. This time in northern Kentucky, high winds and heavy rain creating some major problems there. Nine on your sides, John Genovese has been tracking the damage. He joins us live right now with how it all looks. John. Well, given the power of this storm, things could have been much worse. But once it all calmed down, there were still plenty of folks left cleaning up. Heavy rain, lightning, hail. And wind, that's it. Amid tornado scares and a flash flood warning. A lot of heavy wind and a big crash. Boom. Outside Ted Newby's Owenton home, the biggest damage was dealt from a tree limb that went tumbling, knocking out power to him and his neighbors. Television, she did. Boom. Out. On Thursday night throughout northern Kentucky, split trunks like this were hardly a surprise. It started getting kind of windy and the rain suddenly started picking up. Behind Daniel Stutler's home in Florence, this massive tree came to rest dangling on a power line and play set. At first I thought that was maybe it was, just, it was thunder off into the distance, but it wasn't. Raymond Armijo watched it fall. It just it came straight clean down. It took about I want to say 10 to 15 seconds for the train to clean snap. With some deciding to get a head start on the cleanup. I'm trying to get a chainsaw and start cutting down some limbs. Everyone we spoke with says after weather like this, they're more than ready for the weekend. It's been pretty crazy. Uh, the scatteredness of them, it makes it difficult. Now, given the warnings that were issued in Owen County, even the firefighters there tell me they're surprised the damage wasn't worse. For now, reporting live, John Genovese, 9 on your side.